This is not clickbait. For a limited time in Pixel Gun 3D, you could buy the ultimatum for 500 gems. Boy, the developers messed up with the latest update. Welcome everyone, my name is Pixel Echo. We're back on the Echo on Android account. Like I said, the developers messed up. Now they have fixed this, but let me show you what went wrong. That was a screenshot that I seen on the official Pixel Gun Discord page. Tons of people were sharing these images. Anyway, to start off with, if you go to Armory, you scroll down to the ultimatum, you can see here you cannot purchase this at all. Right, if we go to Battle, we go to Classic Mode, we go to Private Matches, for example... We're going to create a brand new map here. We're just going to do the password, whatever it's going to be. That'll do. And we're going to load in to Classic Pool. And I'm going to show you this in real time. <laughs> Honestly, bro. I, I don't know I don't know if anybody got the ultimatum. If you did, let me know. Click on Random Team. Right. At this stage, go on Armory. And then scroll down until you see Ultimatum. Bro, you can buy it for 135,000 gems. So, of course, the way they fixed this is they added a 1 and a 3 before the 500. But it wasn't just that because players were also able to purchase the Disc Battle Station. Not sure if it was shown for 600 gems or 500 gems. But people could buy them. The developers messed up. I actually missed it. This happened like an hour or two ago by the time you're watching this video. Not sure if they're going to revert that. But you could purchase so many things. The anniversary automatic peacemaker could be purchased. If we go into the backups. Not sure if there was anything inside of here that we could buy. Uh, that's already available. Yes, you could buy the duck hunter. 56,000 gems bro like if i've honestly if i had the gems i would go ahead and buy it now if you do click on buy it is gonna say you don't have enough gems the developers have done a temp fix I expect this to be removed very very soon well any weapon that was available for the 10th anniversary could be purchased for a limited time so if you were super quick you were able to grab these weapons. Like, what's this one? That is the napalm. Nobody really cares about that. What are the, I don't think there was too many inside of here that could have been purchased. In terms of snipers, people could buy the anniversary champion rifle for 90,000 gems. And then we had the scouters, 56,000. Can't buy that inside of there. That's completely fine as well. And then if we go to the heavy section... Also available was the Anniversary Big Buddy for 90,000 gems. But again, they weren't originally 90,000. I think it was like 900, 500, 600. What else was available? Not inside of there. Uh, the Laser Minigun. I mean, it's not exactly a great weapon anyway. The Perfect Rocket Launcher, 56,000. People were able to purchase the Battle Falcon. So loads of people did manage to purchase these weapons for a very limited time. So yeah, all you had to do was go into a private game. Because if we back out one more time. And we go into my armory here. You'll notice that I can't purchase the ultimatum. I can't purchase the anniversary big buddy. It didn't matter if you went into a private game. Or if you went into a public game. But I just want to try one more thing. I did try and see if it was available to purchase inside of the gallery. The answer is no. Same applies in public lobbies. If you go to Armory and you scroll down and try and purchase the ultimatum, you can for 13,500. I think I said 135,000. No, 13,500 by the looks of it. Would you spend that for the ultimatum? I mean, I've got 9519. I would be definitely tempted on my Echo on Android account. But yeah, funny glitch. Some people were able to take advantage of it. If you missed it, you missed it not happening anytime soon.